Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I really appreciate all of your love and support. In this reading, we're going to find out what does the person on your mind feel about your last conversation. Today is the 17th of July, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 9.16 a.m. Okay, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me the person on Libra's mind right now. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> How do they feel about their last conversation? Now, Libra, think about the person on your mind. I mean, think about the person that you like to know how they feel about your last conversation. Wow, there's death at the bottom of the deck, so it can indicate transformation or there was an ending between you and this person since the last conversation. Um, and look at the tower here and look at the world here. Okay, a couple of versions in this reading. The first version would be for those of you, if really your last conversation has caused an ending with the death here, okay? Hangman in reverse, if there was an ending, they feel like now I see things in a different perspective. Now I see how challenging this is going to be to your cups in reverse, how challenging it is to, to reunite, to reconcile. Um, two of Pentacles here is in reverse. A decision has been made because of someone revealing how they truly feel, or it could be secrets being revealed, or it could be finally having um, this clarity about what's truly going on, um, the root of the issues, right? And the Five of Cups here is the one first. They feel like they try, I would say that since the last conversation, they try to see the positives of the situation and maybe the world here can indicate, maybe this is all going to boil over, this is just going to, you know, be in the past. And maybe both of you can start over in the future but not right now okay so because the king of wands here is in love first that means they're not thinking about taking any actions as of right now the king of wands in love first yeah it's a fire energy aries sagittarius leo and we've got the tower here in love first they feel like it's best if they don't do anything don't say anything to so that they don't further cause any more upheaval in this situation in this connection okay hmm. if you separate it from this person or that they also may be feeling with the world here like you you're done with them and that you are moving on you've closed the chapter with them and that you're moving on okay and the second version would be the death here indicates a huge transformation right so since your last conversation, you may have changed their perspective of you, who you are as a person, and perhaps the moon here in reverse indicates them, maybe there was some sort of misunderstanding, right? They may have had doubts about you, but now it's in reverse. They don't have doubts about you anymore. And the two of pentacles in reverse indicates a decision. So they feel a little bit more sure about you. Five of cups here is in reverse. A little bit more sure and seeing a little bit more positive things about you or what, you, what you've got to say. And the tower in reverse, just in the nick of time before they maybe pull the plug or say something that's going to hurt the situation but the king of wands here is in love first so they feel like okay let's not do anything ever ever since the last conversation let's just give it some time because they're not taking any actions and the world here again it's like to you know death the world to leave the things behind, whatever the doubts were, 
some unhappiness here through your cups and lovers, not being able to see eye to eye or work as a team. And let's start a new because the world can indicate that as well. Okay, again, take what resonates with you. It's a general reading. We're just gonna see a little bit more here. Devil and my verse, three of wands and my verse. I see another version of this story. For some of you, if you're involved with a third, with this person, and it's a third party situation. Maybe they feel like you've turned your back on them because they put you in a third party situation unless you're the one who put them in a third party situation. So they could be feeling like they want to turn their back on you because of the third party situation. Third party as in love triangle situation. I feel like this is related to love, this third version of the storyline here. And we've got the five pentacles here in my verse. see a little bit more magician and one first ace of pentacles and one first yeah there's an ending here i feel like yeah they felt very really, really overwhelmed with the king of cups here in my verse if this is a third party situation they felt really overwhelmed they had to choose they had to turn their back on either one of you it could be you it could be the other person I feel like turning back on the newer connection, okay? The newer connection, because ace, ace of Pentacles here, yeah, Ace of Pentacles is a new connection, and it's in reverse. So they may feel like I, might, I may have to turn my back on the new connection. I don't know whether you are the new connection or you are the original connection, okay? See, Three of Cups here is also in reverse. Someone's got to go, right? They feel like someone's got to go. Party is over. And three is a crowd. If this is a third party situation, okay? Uh, well, sometimes third party can also, you know, may not mean like a love triangle. It could also be like some external factors or internal factors. Something has got to go. Mm-hmm. But if there's not a third party situation, they they feel overwhelmed by again if there's a separation. There's so many cards that indicate a separation, unhappiness, someone turning one's back on the other. Like I cannot do anything anymore about this with the magician or well, first. It's just too much to handle, too challenging. And it's bad for my emotions, bad for my psyche. Either they feel that about you or that they feel you feel that about them okay ever since the last conversation all right libra this is your reading i hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you like to book me my information is in the description box below feel free to subscribe to my other channel it's called chelsea vlogs it's my travel channel and for those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. And I do go live once in a while. So again, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Take care, Libra. I hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.